So and so this is this is from ex years of work of research <laughs> in Russian bars drinking gin tonics. <laughs> so Doug, explain what the uh, what's the ingredient that's going to make this effect, and what should we see? So basically, like a, a blue glow. It looks like a, a similar to like the blue glow, uh, maybe from Cherenkov radiation in a nuclear reactor. Of course, there's nothing nuclear here, <laughs> but uh, it's a similar sort of uh, color anyway. And so the the thing that makes the tonic water glow blue like that is is the quinine inside. And so the quinine actually absorbs the ultraviolet radiation from the blue light or the black light and then re-emits it uh, in, in the blue All right. end of the spectrum. So, and you can, here we have a glass of water, a glass of tonic water. You can put some uh, gin in that and <laughs> it makes a nice drink. So will they be able to see the effect or is it really <clears throat> not pronounced? Uh, oh, it's very pronounced. Well, that's, that's what we're gonna, right. we're, we're gonna show, right? So we're gonna start on this side. And the, so the, the, you should, uh, the readers or the viewers should try to figure out uh, you know, can you tell which one is the uh, tonic water and which one is just the plain water? And so already right now you should be able to a little bit see. Yeah, you see that, that blue glow? And if you bring it over to the side, like that. And then... The, the thing is like, it, uh, hold on, move it around a bit. Yeah, see like right there, that's that's really good for the camera. Like, it doesn't look good from our angle, but it just actually depends on the camera's angle, right? So you can see that blue glow on the top of the tonic. And maybe move it completely behind it as well, yeah, facing. Yeah, uh, behind it works, I mean. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, there, oh, there you go. Good idea. Holy smoke, look at that. Yeah, it's good. Oh, this, this will be like a video of that guy who saw the double rainbow. <laughs> oh, it's so beautiful, it's so beautiful. <laughs> How many physicists does it take to be amazed? Dude, actually, that was, the, that was the best one when put you it, put it behind it. And yeah. put it behind the other one, too, though. Sorry. So the other one, you should... Yeah, there's some kind of circuit in there. Okay. It, it's, it's a little bit persnickety. But no, when you had it behind it, it was like very... So that one you don't see hardly. Anything. I mean, you, you see the you see you blue light. You see, yeah, well, you see the black light coming through. Yeah. Which he keeps saying blue because it's in the yeah. it's in the inf or the uh, ultraviolet spectrum, not the which is more blue. So it it matches well with the the glow of the cup can, can plus put, the. Can uh, you, wait, can you tilt it, tilt, it, tilt down, it down? Tilt it Yeah, put it, put it behind like you had it, but then tilt it. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's good. And that's quinine. Also, has a lot of good medicinal, uh, there's an anti-malarial, uh, things like a, a prophylactic. Anyway, if you have some gin and tonics and some quinine, and you're in India or someplace where malaria is rampant, you can tell yourself you're doing the right thing. <laughs> I mean, cool, that that's that that was the best one probably. Like when you when you slid it from one to the other. All right. Cool.